My name is Agnes. I worked as a census coordinator in 2011 and uh, it was an exciting project. It was a huge project. I was responsible for North Bansbury, which is in Islington, London, and it is a vibrant, diverse area. We have a big Turkish community and uh, Eritrean community and then there's also a mix of people from all over the world. The average person on the street does not know anything about government policies and town planning and all that. Quite often people just think, oh well, um, I've given birth to a child, the child will be registered with a GP, the child will go to school. They don't really see what's behind all that information for that child to be allocated a place at the school. It depends on demand or how many children are born in the area. All, those, all that information that's fed through uh, government bodies that connect, like schools, hospitals, GPs, they all interlink somehow on population data. My role as a coordinator was in the morning, I would check my emails and we had a phone, we all had phones from ONS which we could use for work, but anytime from 8am anyone can ring me with any issues. Uh, for example, uh, one team member lost his uh, ID and you cannot go door knocking without your ID because they don't know who you are and I had to coordinate that and report it as lost and um, obviously we reported with the police, reported with my line manager and reported at the headquarters and they sent him another one within two, two or three days, three working days, which was pretty quite rapid. Every day will be different, there will be other challenges and I'll be getting phone calls, for example, I got a phone call from a chiropodist, they said, oh, we got a form for a residential to complete, we're not, we're a business. I had to go and pick up the phone and make it a void. And these things, little things like that. But otherwise I was available to support my collectors. It was very interesting because I was fortunate enough to work with wonderful groups of people. And we were all sort of like on the same wave path. And we were friends and that really helped. It worked well, it worked fantastically well. And, uh, and I think that coordination or communication lines which were open really did help for our all Islington um, area to do well. You have to be someone who is interested in people, populations, community, and uh, someone who embraces diversity, and someone who actually spends time talking to the diverse populations in your community, and someone who's engaging. Um, there's a lot of people out there, I think sometimes people can be quite shy, they don't know where to ask or where to find this information. It's like, it's like going to vote, it's like having a democratic, um, you're taking part in democracy, you're taking part in shaping the future. And I think a lot of people will be quite interested. <laughs>